What I found pretty quickly as I was talking to small business owners, and in the early days, we were talking with a lot of new business owners or, or at the time, uh, business owners who had had businesses for a while, but hadn't really transitioned to digital at all. Um, and so what I got to really quick was, this is great, but I can't really afford 5,000, 6,000, 8,000 upfront for a website. Or they would say, yeah, I just spent five grand on this website and the website developer put it live, but now I need to make changes to it. And every time they're nickeling and diming for every little change. Um, so it was problems like that. And I was like, huh, I wonder if there's a way to think through this differently. And so what we did is we said, what if we took the cost of development alongside of ongoing changes and we essentially, the way I explain it now is uh, you finance a car and you get a warranty with it. So we took the cost of development, spread it over 18 months, and then we built into that uh, unlimited ongoing changes. So you, at the time, it's almost embarrassing to say how much we charged out of the gate. Uh, I think we started at $150 a month. Wow. Yeah, it was, it was way, still way too cheap. Um, so how, how long did it take for you to realize that was too cheap? Well, it, it took a long enough to realize that about what, um, three months into the business model. So I, I should give a little bit more reference instead of transitioning into this business model. So we were getting flat fees. Uh, we jumped both feet into the business model. So we went from getting, you know, sounds like you jumped head first, not even just both yes, feet. You're right. We did <laughs> head first, not even thinking. Uh, that goes from the lack of experience, right? Um, and so we went from getting what 5,000, 3,000, whatever it was up front to now we have $150. So what three months in, I couldn't pay my first employee. Uh, and I was like, well, this wasn't very smart. So yeah, we realized, okay, we've got to figure out a different way to do this. We made it through that time though. We pushed through, we worked a lot of hours and what eventually started to happen is we raised our prices and we got, it, it got exponential. 